This is my read, and I loved it. It's subversive, written by Seth Rosenfeld, and this is about Berkeley and what went on during the 60s. Fascinating read. Let me uh, read some of the notes that I took. Subversive, radical Berkeley is the birthplace of the atomic bomb. Oppenheimer, Robert, Robert Oppenheimer, its father, was a communist. J. Edgar Hoover's FBI kept a watchful eye over the campus and those associated with it, well past the end of World War II. B-movie star actor Ronald Reagan was an informant for the FBI during the 1940s in Hollywood. He passed names on to the FBI of those Hollywood-connected who were communists. This connection eventually helped Reagan in his run for California governor in the 1960s. Also, Reagan's stance on the Berkeley turmoil would garner him votes also. The author details dissidents involved in and around the Berkeley campus. Clark Kerr, Berkeley's president, added to the campus's problem. There are 231 pages of sources by this award-winning investigative reporter. He fought the FBI for their documents. This is truly a well-written, readable work of narrative fiction. It, it's fascinating because living through the 60s, I grew up in the Bay Area, I was a teenager, I remember many of these things on the television, on the news, and it wasn't quite the way I thought it was, and I'm really glad that there's a book out on it.